Hello, sixth grade. Um, we are talking about lesson 14 using uh, until loops in maze. Okay, number one, puzzle number one. It says, get the angry bird to the pig. Now there's different ways we can do this. Uh, we're supposed to be using different, um, let's just try it using the repeat block. So move forward five times uh, we're going to turn left and I think we're just going to repeat that three times I think let's see okay, let's try four times simple repeat block re nested inside of another repeat block okay here's the here's the video that goes with this Chris Bosch if some of you know who he every is. athlete knows that you get good by practicing by repeating the same moves until you get really good or until you reach your goal when I was in high school I wouldn't leave practice until I made 10 free throws in a row Similarly, when you get to a computer program and repeat a command, you can give it an exact number of times to repeat. Or you can define a goal and tell it to repeat the command until it reaches some goal. In the next example, the repeat block is changed. Instead of specifying how many times you want it to repeat, you can use the repeat until block to tell the angry bird to do the same thing until it gets the pig or until it crashes into a wall. And again, we can put multiple blocks inside the loop and repeat a series of actions. Okay. That's two. You get credit for doing that. Just by, just by clicking on that video. Okay. Uh, take a close look at the code below. What do you think will happen when you click run? So it says repeat until repeat until pig. While path ahead, move forward, and then turn left. Um, the pig will make it, the bird will make it to the pig. Okay. So the answer was B, if you're worried about getting that correct. Okay, so we're going to repeat until pig. Move forward. Turn right, move forward, turn left, right? Right? If he is turning right, let's see what happens. <laughs> repeat until pig, move forward, turn right, move forward, turn left. So we didn't have to put it, the repeat button in there and say, do it five times. All right, let's move on to number five. Same deal. You know, we are, we're gonna repeat until the sunflower. Move forward, turn left, move forward, turn right. Let's see, I think this is gonna work. Brains. discussion in class today about why would a zombie eating sunflowers make him seem like he's been successful I thought zombies ate something else all right continue on to number six okay same deal wild path ahead so we're just going to use wild blocks a wild path ahead move forward if path turns to the if path to the left, we're gonna turn left. Brains. <laughs> if you if you can't keep up with the video, what you have to do is just pause the video, um, solve your puzzle, and then restart it.
All right, number seven. Um, so he's going to move forward, turn right, turn right. Okay, if move forward, if path ahead, if path, I think this is right, and then we're going to change if path to the right, turn right. Brains. I think this is right. So they want us to only use five blocks. So we're going to move forward, turn left. Okay. So let's repeat again until move forward. If path to the left, turn left. And that would be five blocks. I don't know if you remember earlier. In earlier lessons, we did this and we'd have to have like dozens of blocks. We're going to need five here using the until block. again just so you have time to look at it and we'll move on to number nine so here's the the, the challenge puzzle so so he's gonna he's gonna have to flip around turn right turn right and then make his okay so we're gonna turn right turn right and that's gonna flip him around uh, move, move forward, turn right. I'm trying. I'm trying to go from memory here. It while path ahead, move forward. If path to the left, turn left. Brains. Let's change it to right. Let's see if that works better. Brains. Nope, that's not going to work either. <sighs> okay, let me think. I think I remember he's going to have to go down like this, turn left. Um, if Panther Head moved forward. Brains. Pretty sure it's this way. Brains. I could be wrong again. <sighs> I'm going to try it this way again. Brains. For a hint, repeat until. Oh, okay. So let's do it this way. Brains. No. Okay. Okay. 
So that's what I was doing wrong. You can see it, it's repeat until wall path ahead, move forward, and then turn left under that. Okay. And then we're going to put this in here. No, that there. And there's Brains. There we go. Turn right, turn right, move forward, turn right, repeat until, and then inside of that wild path ahead, move forward, and then under the wild path ahead, if path to the left, turn left. All right, number 10. Let's look at number 10. And I think I had this one already. Repeat, move forward. It's the same thing, other word, turning right instead of left. Brains. puzzle is it's a question look at the code carefully below what will happen when you click Brian so it's repeat until forward turn right so he's going to move forward I think I'm going to choose A. I am not sure. Brains. So I was correct. Brains. Okay. So that's it, guys and girls. I hope that you start coming to class because this is easier when, when we do it together. Definitely easier when we do it together. Thank you so much, and I hope to see you next week. Bye.